so that's me checked out of the hotel not too bad you can check out from the television in the room found my way down to the lobby and eventually to the car park got myself some food a nice little sandwich and a coffee from a very well-known brand i'm now going to do a bit of driving so uh, the next leg of my journey takes me 45 minutes from here but overall i have about five hours worth of driving today so it's half past 11 in the morning i better get cracking going to take me over the bridge or um, over, the, uh, over the dam or wow or if I'm going to be able to see it because if I'm on it I can't see it how the hell do they build these things I see it I see the dam dam <laughs> that's what I call it in that. 200 yards you will arrive at your destination okay I'm actually going to drive over the dam. Right, so I just parked up and I'm at the Hoover Dam. Sunny and hot today. I'm going to go over to my cool glasses. Okay. You want to see the Hoover Dam? my way here I'm at the Hoover Dam about 45 minutes drive outside of Vegas and this is it right behind me what an awesome sight <laughs> right so I'm now got a three and a half hour drive to my next location and that takes me an hour past the hotel which I'm staying at tonight. So three and a half hours to where I'm going and then an hour almost back of myself. So that's four and a half hours driving and it's currently two o'clock in the afternoon. So if I'm going to make it before nightfall I better hurry up. Big bridge over there. I think I might be going over that in a second. But that bridge you just saw a second ago? I think we're going over it. There's high walls because uh, it gets so windy along this bridge. If these walls weren't here, you'd probably get blown off the thing. So, can't see as much as I thought, and mud. Right, so quickly just filled up with fuel. So now I have a full tank of gas. I have 216 miles to my next destination, which is going to take about 3 hours, 21 minutes. Standing at the door, I'm on the way. quite deep into Arizona now. I'm about 30 miles beyond the fuel station with about 180 miles to go. Yeah, I am done. 125 miles to go and two hours on the journey. I should be there by half six to see you. Made it to the Grand Canyon and I've missed the sunset because it took so long to get here. And then I parked in the wrong place and had to sprint the other quarter of a mile. But I'm here. Setting up a goal to grow from. 
Okay, so that was a bit of an adventure. Um, so I've just drove out to the Grand Canyon from Vegas, and the distances are enormous. Even if you go and even if you're speeding, it's just the distances are enormous. Um, and I've been going 75, which is the speed limit a lot of the way, all the way here, and I made it just after the sun set. But I didn't get its full effect. Now, if I'd arrived half an hour earlier, I would have seen a beautiful sunset. So that sucks. That and it costs thirty dollars to get in. Five miles away, there's a gate you have to pay to get in, which is. Uh, um, I need to look at a map and figure it out because I'm staying in a city called Flagstaff tonight, which is a fair old distance from here. If I can, I might come back tomorrow. So what actually happened was on the way in here, my sat nav took me into Grand Canyon Village, which was like a housing estate almost. People live here. There's schools here. People people work and live here. And I couldn't find the damn Grand Canyon and I'm running out of daylight. So eventually I found a car park which I was allowed to park in. And then I asked someone as I was walking around trying to find it where it is. And it's a quarter of a mile walk. So I had to sprint that as fast as I could. And I made it after sunset but when it was still light enough. Now my cameras are good enough to pick up low light. But I missed the best opportunity. And But I don't know. I'm not one to be beaten. So... My new plan is, I might come back here tomorrow, even though it's like a two hour drive from where I'm staying. It's gonna be longer driving, but I'll, I'll figure it out. If I'm really ambitious, and I don't know if I can do it, because sleep and time, I could try and get back to the sunrise. That'd be just as good. But, I'll probably miss that too. So, so I've gotta figure it all out with some Airbnbs, and I'll book that when I get back to my hotel. So, uh, just make it up as I go along. Yeah. Right, so I've made it to a car park. Oh yeah, and there's something over there. It's only the goddamn Grand Canyon. <laughs> 